Hello, I'm Diane. Um, I'm back and I want to show the hairstyle again. Uh, yeah, that's day of three. Yeah. Yeah, we're going to work with uh, more colors. Lighting up like platinum, like you have, and then with colors in it. Yes. Okay, mm -hmm. so make a, yeah, a playful, sunny hairstyle. Will you turn around so you can see how your current hairstyle yes. is? Thank you very much. Let's start on you. <laughs> Hello friends on YouTube. First model of the new year. So I wish you all a very healthy, wonderful, strong 2023. And I hope it will be a wonderful year. And I hope you have a lot of fun on YouTube watching my videos. But for now, I start on this hairstyle. Start this course with protection. Have this beautiful new capes. So I put them on the end of the video so you can see the brand of it. They have them in multi colors, so the whole rainbow of colors, so they are wonderful. And I start with wetting the hair. Before I start, I take a leave in conditioner. I spray a little bit on the hairs because the blonde hairs can always be nursed and it is much easier to cut. Put on my own glasses. Take a comb. Comb the moist through the hairs. Dry ends. On top. Zo mooi blond hoor. Ja, wit hè? Ja, is echt wit. Starting on top, start where I think the fall of the hairs will be. So I start on the sides, take the hairs up, lay them in the line of falling. Take off the dry ends. The dry part is uh, the rest over of summertime. This is the last half centimeter till centimeter. Zit je goed op deze stoel? Ja. Yeah. Gewoon een stoel, hoor. Want ik kan nog wel. Want ik had laatst ook iemand die zei van ja, ik vind die kruk echt een beetje lastig zitten. Always work in the fall of hairs, so you think apart in the straight line, but it's not. I turn a bit so you can see where apart. So I lay the hairs in the natural fall, take them up in the natural fall. So you see, I go into the flow of the hairs, so I get a better end result. Go to the first line I cut. Then travel over the center of the scalp, especially with short hair. And when it's short, it's short. Mm -hmm. You cannot change it. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. When it's gone, it's gone. Especially in winter time, you have more uh, structure to the hair by the hair pulling of the muscles on the hairs. So therefore, it's better to work in the lines of the natural fall because then you use the natural shaping of the hairs to create the style you want. Coming on the center, I'll have myself a guideline so you can see the guideline here. Take the hairs up, go to the guideline, holding some length on the rounding. And travel nicely over the roundings of the skull, leaning with my hand palm on the skull, so I have always a guide also in my hand. Makes it also more stable. When I come on the center line in, in the back, you see it turning. So you see the hair 
going flowing into deadline. So I go also in that line. I really love to work with the natural lines. Connect them on the line of cutting. Go into the roundings of the skull lines. Find myself the skull bone. Now Diane has not, not a very strong skull bone, she has a bit flat skull bone. So when I come on the line where the skull bone is, I go deeper in. So I create myself more volume on the rounding, so I have a better shape afterwards. Even though she has beautiful skull, because she has no strange effects in it, it's just nice, easy going. Soms even die mensen even die bubbels in het hoofd. Ja. In deuken heb jij helemaal niet. Control the line of cutting. Pointing always to the center of the skull lines. Go a little bit over the center and then I know the lines go that way. So I have to follow that line also. So I go in like this, leaning with my knuckles on my head, creating that volume around here. Shall we go to the other side? Go a little bit higher up. Correct the line a bit. It's not much, but all small things you can see on short hairstyles. So you have to correct them. Yeah, that's true. Yeah. I only speak the truth and nothing but the truth. <laughs> so help me God. I don't want to lie. Lying breaks nothing. So you see how wonderful the shape is and how wonderful the lines fall into the natural lining. Take the hairs up on the contour line. Pointing in the natural lines. The natural line is for example, the chin line is also the underline of the eyes. You can always find the lines. Work till it gets above the ear. Above the ear, I'd get the rounding to the other side. So there it's shuffle the other way around. Een klein rotting. Jij hebt hier dan niet zo heel veel, zou je denken? Nee. Koffiepads en uh, theezakjes. Pull the ear softly down. Holding some length on the front. Lay the ass back. Soften the line a bit. Push the ear to the front, go into the same line, then go on the line of cutting above the ear, take the hairs up, correct them, and connect them to the lines on the back. Clean the contour line. Holding all the lines nice and soft because platinum is a strong color, but it's also nice when the lines are not too strong, so it's much nicer to see the lines. Take only the parts above the ear in the center, a little bit up, get rid of a little bit weight. It's only this part. So 
so I have no weight on the ears and I know she wears glasses so when the glass is laying there the holder of on the ears she has more freedom of the hairs otherwise it sticks out like that so that's why I take a little bit of rounding around here come on logies man yeah, so fine. <laughs> yeah, you develop, thank you. Go to the other side. <laughs> Do the same, or almost the same. Starting on top, get to the line of cutting, go to the front. Take the part in front of the ear till I get above the ear. Connect the lines on top. I think as I a clock have, that it will be better work. That you need for each step here. Ja, maar het is heel moeilijk werken, dat snap je zelf ook wel. Ja. Want als je moet werken is het wel fijn als er iets een ritme is. Het ja. maakt niet uit wat het is, al is het herrie. Het is echt wel beter. Van de week zat ik buiten, dan hoor ik de snelweg. En zelfs dat is mooi geluid, als je niks hebt. Soft on the contour line. Don't lead on the skin too hard, because I still have to bleach the hairs. So I don't want the protection of, of the skin. Lay the hairs down, go in from above the ear, set out the side beard, lay the hairs to the front, go in from the front, coming in the rounding, first connect the front to the back, so I give this rounding. Then have more freedom above the ear. And above the ear, I did the same as I did on the other side. Take away a little bit of the weight so our glasses can lay freely on the ears without pushing out the hairs. Zit ik een beetje voor mezelf natuurlijk, maar maakt niet uit. Take the hairs up and connect them to the line of cutting. Slice a little bit into the contour line and into the line of the upper lines and the fall of the skull. This side sticks a little bit out, so I hold my scissor a little bit more flat instead of straight. Take a little bit of the weight and the length in the same line. The grotere kant. Coming to the underlines, work till I get on the rounding I created myself on the volume of the skull bone. I really love scissor of comb techniques because they are beautiful and soft. Turn a bit. Go to the line that I created. 
go from the left and the right into the line of cutting. And I see some comments on YouTube of people who think that women with short hair are men. I think you have to go to the doctor. Because in your mindset there's something really wrong. A woman or a girl always stays a woman or a girl. It's never a man. So please spare me that comment. Mm -hmm. Dat is zo'n stom commentaar namelijk. Dat slaat helemaal nergens op. Ja, yeah. mm -hmm. you're beautiful with short hair. From this part behind the ears, get to the line of cutting. Slice on the line of cutting. Heb ik geluid? It's mostly ultra quiet in my salon, or studio, it's a, it's a studio, it's not a salon. But sometimes we have music from the factory below. The machines work and then oh, we have a sound. Thank God for that. Mm -hmm. I have also with digital geluiden gewerkt, but there are people who are very angry. Dat je de hele tijd zo'n geluidje was, zo'n TikTok geluidje ja. is. Ik weet niet wat zegt. Want je moet er ook in kunnen knippen en plakken natuurlijk. Dat schept ja. er ook wel niks aan. Nee, dat klopt. Again on the line that I created, I use some slice techniques to make it a bit, bit more playful. Clean the contour line. <laughs> Holding the line ultra soft. Ah, what a mooi geluid. Mm -hmm. yeah. <laughs> Lema come in to the line of cutting. Holding some length by guiding with the goal. And don't lean on the skin. I told you I still have to bleach the hairs. So I don't want to lose the protection of the skin. It's <laughs> so Fijn, hè? Goed die zijn. Mm -hmm. Die kleine kinderen die ook anders zijn. Die kruipen helemaal in elkaar. Dus dat is echt wel leuk om te zien. Ik hou er wel van. <laughs> Coming to the front. Coming to the front. Lay my sister on the skull. Slicing in long lines so I can hold length but I give also very diverse spectrum of hairs. I really love Keone's scissors, they are really sharp. And they always deliver what the, yeah, you want of the scissor.
Ja, wel een mooi geluidje wat dit. Mm-hmm. Ik weet niet wat het is, dat denk ik een soort schuwmachine of zo. Ja, dat denk ik ook. I think by now the hair style is ready. So I can make her bleach. Okay, made the bleach, made the uh, rover hair bleach. 20 volume, that's 6%. For those who ask me about the percent, we in the Netherlands work with percent. You all over the world work, work with volumes. So that's why I use both the combination. Put in step one of the glint line. I always like to bring in protection for so well the skin. Although at best, of course, for the hairs, but the skin is the most important thing we have because tear out the grows the hairs. And the step one gives a wonderful protection with coloring, bleaching, and even with perming. And so I said it all her hair. Make sure there's enough on the contour line because they dry out a little bit. But with the conditioner in it, uh, it hardly dries out. So you have more moist into the product. You see I left the, the length out. Peel a little bit of my carton wick. Lay it on the skin because the heating of the plastic foil can be irritating the skin. Because the plastic and the bleach heat up a bit. So this I lay on the contour line. I'll tell you afterwards how long it took to get platinum blonde. And what I did, if I use the toner or not, and then we go for the new coloring. But first we have to go to the light bulbs. So close this up. And you just stay there because you don't have to go away. We have because otherwise it gets sick here on the same spot. Now we want some music and something to drink. <laughs> so we'll be back. Before uh, we start with the new colors, uh, I rinse it out after uh, 20 minutes, because that was more than enough. Didn't put a toner on it, just a silver shampoo and a silver conditioner. Color blow dry the hairs and then put the other colors on. Lay the hairs into the fall in which I'm going to color the hair. Has to be dry, of course. So far. Then I mix uh, two colors into uh, a bowl a real copper, orange copper. And an ultra soft golden copper line. And this, with this color, I got it drawn into the hairstyle. Made it both with the 3% as 10 volume. So it doesn't damage the hair at all. But first, of course, I have to mix them. Ultra flat brushes. Yeah, this flat. Otherwise, I cannot draw with it. With the golden colors, it must look like you did something with, uh, yeah, like an artist. You still have to see the blonde, but you also have to see the nice effect of the colors. So it gives ultra. Festival feeling.
this what I told you is the, the lightest color. Put a photo of the colors in the back with the photos. And this you have to do by feeling. I cannot explain feeling because feeling is a, something that comes from your stomach and is controlled by your soul. So you have to go by that trust your inner feelings. And the beautiful thing is when you do this with 3%, then 10 volume, you can always get rid of it because it's not going deep into the hairs. Ik vind het eigenlijk wel een beetje spannend. Ja, leuk toch? Ja. Ik vind het wel leuk dat je het ook een beetje spannend vindt. Stel je het niet spannend zou vinden, zou het ook niet goed zijn toch? Nee, niet dat is waar. Go to the copper lines. Make, they're a little bit stronger because they are on the six level. So you also have fine parts of that. All those colors will be transparent afterwards because the base where you color on is of course ultra ultra light. So you get ultra light shades of color. And she's very excited about it. I did a lot of coloring so for me it's less exciting <laughs> but I can feel her stomach feelings. And I really like that because I know she's alive now. <laughs> and it's a girl and she's kicking. But I love it when you do things you normally not do. <laughs> and she has beautiful photos of every, every hairstyle I made on her. So this will be new line of photos. Certain of that. And she lives in Amsterdam, so what the heck. <laughs> <laughs> when somebody tells you nasty thing, you said you're a stone man. <laughs> Go to the coffee shop. Watch over if I did all the calls right. This I leave in for 15 minutes, that's more than enough. Because it activates also on the peroxide that's still into the hair. So always is a rest over peroxide. Then we rinse it out and then we come for end styling. The record of the other is that it's fine now, you feel it warm in the furnace. A heel mooi with Chris returned it. And then the lockers are in lockers. Yeah, that's always. Yeah, that's actually really nice. Het mooiste product voor dit soort haren. Mm -hmm. Ik gebruik eigenlijk bijna altijd op uh, lichter gekleurde haren en uh, dat soort dingen. Platina is altijd kristalkun. Dus het is echt het mooiste product op de rest voor de haar. En het wordt niet vet. Mm -hmm. En het is toch verzorgd. Ja, het ruikt ook heel lekker. Ja, het is een mooi product, heel eerlijk. Especially with short hair on the underlines, you can better feel the heat of the blow dryer. And you can also massage the skin a bit because uh, it's got a bit tight by bleaching. Now, so far blow drying. In the meantime we talked about the best product for bleached hair is uh, Crystal Turn. It's a product of Goldwell but also KMS in the States. And the beautiful thing about this product is it never greases the hair, brings out all the colors but also holds the bleached hair on a wonderful condition. And you don't have to wash it every night because every day you put a little bit on it and the hair stays in a wonderful, yeah, wonderful line, color, smoothness, shiny effect but not too. This is her new hairstyle for 2023. Take off the protection. Thank you for being my model. Thank you for watching. She will turn around to show you the end result 
And we see each other next video. Bye bye. Yeah, super leuk. Thank you. Hello, I'm Diane. Um, I'm back and I want a short hairstyle again. Uh, and that's day of three.